In the 1970s, a Soviet family raised pet lions at home. The outcome was unimaginable. Meet the Berberovs, a family from Baku, Azerbaijan, who became famous throughout the Soviet Union for their extraordinary choice of pets. Lev Berberov, an architect by profession, had a lifelong love for wild animals. So it was no surprise when the family decided to bring home a sick lion cub they found at the zoo. They named him King, and against all odds, they nursed him back to health. King became part of the family, living in their small apartment and even going for walks in the local park. The Soviets and the foreign press were fascinated by King's story. He starred in movies and captured the hearts of many. But tragedy struck when King attacked a passerby and was shot and killed by a police officer. The family was devastated. Determined not to let their love for lions fade, the Berberovs found another lion cub, King II, to join their family. However, King II proved to be more demanding and independent than his predecessor. And after the death of Lev Berberov, the family faced financial difficulties in taking care of him. Then, on a fateful day in 1980, everything changed. When Nina Berberova, Lev's wife, came home from work, she found King II behaving strangely. In a horrifying turn of events, he attacked and killed their 14-year-old son, Roman. The police were called, and they had no choice but to shoot King II. The Berberov's world came crashing down. Nina Berberova, devastated by the loss of her son, contemplated suicide. But with the support of her daughter and a friend, she found the strength to carry on. Today, the Berberovs no longer keep wild animals in their home. They have moved on, but the scars of their tragic story remain. Join us as we delve into the gripping and heart-wrenching story of the Berberovs, a family who dared to raise pet lions at home only to face unimaginable consequences.